What's up guys? Here's your at-home workout for Saturday, April 4th. You've got two parts of this workout. The first part is 15 minutes on the clock. You're gonna do as many rounds and reps of, as possible. Five pull-ups, 10 push-ups, 15 air squats. If you guys don't have a pull-up bar at home or a place to do pull-ups, find like a ledge of a tabletop where you can lean underneath the tabletop and pull yourself. Or you guys can put a barbell across the squat rack lean back and you pull up that way. So, otherwise, five pull-ups. Arms go straight at the bottom, chin above the top, into 10 push-ups. Sternum touches the ground, and that's it there. Make sure you get a good lock out. Finally, finish the 15 air squats. And we just did air squats this week and we ran the mile with you guys to be pretty comfortable there. A good goal for this would be one round every minute. So 15 rounds total would be a really good goal for this. I think everybody should shoot for 10 or more. It kind of comes down to the pull-ups and the push-ups. Then, rest as needed. We'll probably take a two or three minute break. We're gonna go into five rounds. Whatever dumbbells you want, you can use two different weights if you need. But it's 10. Standing French presses or extensions. Then 10 alternating curls, whatever form you want. In each arm, so 20 total. And then we go into 10 very explosive, so five on each leg, jumping split lunges. The idea is to get as open and as high as you can with the legs and with the hips, right? Rest a minute after each one of those rounds. That's your at-home workout for tomorrow. Next week, we've got three workouts a day for you guys.